Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Dana and this is Delighted to DIY. For this DIY, you're going to need one package of the bamboo sticks from Dollar Tree. Using four long ones, we're going to make the frame of our garden obelisk. Um, I used two long ones and then took another one, so a fifth long one, and used my Fisker's gardening shears to trim them down. These are going to become the supports around the bottom. Using the hot glue, I glued them in place. Then I took jute twine from the Dollar Tree and wrapped them in an X shape to secure them in place so that it would be a long-term hold and make it more secure. Today's video is part of an open playlist hosted by Heidi Sambel DIY. She is a beyond amazing, super creative, very talented um, creator here on YouTube and makes the most amazing DIYs. She's one of my favorites. Um, be sure to check her out. I'll have her channel linked in my description box, as well as a link for the playlist to check out all the other DIYers and creators who have made things for this summer themed playlist. Next, using the frame that we just put together, I laid it on top of two more of the long bamboo sticks from Dollar Tree to get an average or uh, approximate sizing. I used my marker to mark this in place on those two sticks. Then again, repeated the steps that we did in the first one where I put hot glue down to glue them in place for a short-term hold and then use the jute tw twine. Oh my gosh, my voice, my words, blah. Anyways, <laughs> took the twine and wrapped it around to secure them in an X shape um, anywhere that two of the bamboo um, sticks met. Unfortunately, I didn't get footage of the next step where I used two more bamboo sticks to make the square shape. Um, I used the twine and just went around all three pieces where they connected in an X shape. But you'll see what I do um, in this next level up. It's the same process that I did for the first level. So I measured out the bamboo sticks and cut them to a smaller size because it's going to be going into a tapered a teepee sort of shape. Um, so your next level up, the second level now that we're working on is slightly smaller and then the third level will be even smaller than that. But it's the same process um, where I use some hot glue to hold it in place, then start wrapping some jute twine around then place another one underneath and then take the jute twine and wrap it in an X shape around all three areas wherever um, the bamboo sticks connect. So once you have all four in place in your second row, you're gonna then repeat it one more time for the top. So you'll have three levels all together. Um, and again, it's just the same thing of holding it in place with some hot glue. I did, I found that doing two sides opposite each other um, was easiest. And then I would place the third and fourth um, underneath the first two that I put on. Um, again, hold it in place with hot glue and then take the twine and wrap it around in an X shape. I started each twine with some hot glue, um, then would wrap it around and then ended each um, wrapping with some hot glue, pressing it down as it's shown before. And of course, as always, if you like what you see, it'd be awesome if you could give this video a thumbs up or consider sharing it with your friends. Um, if you want to see more of my DIYs to come, it'd be awesome if you subscribe. And if you hit on the bell, it'll notify you. YouTube will notify you every time that I upload a new video. Once you have all three levels completed, this is what you're going to have. 
The next thing I did was decided that I wanted to add two um, more bamboo sticks on the top that will hold a pot, a small pot. So I trimmed them down as you see there again with my Fiskars um, gardening shears. I found they work the best to cut them. Some were harder to cut than others and some cut like butter. Anyways, I took the two sticks, kind of separated them, made sure the pot fit on them and everything was kind of stable. I used some E6000 in hot glue for a short and long-term hold. However, I found the E6000 wasn't doing the best job and I had some super glue from the Dollar Tree. It was a quick set in three seconds and man, did this stuff hold. Um, I could pick up the whole shelf from one of those sticks now I began embellishing the obelisk. I took two packs of the small string lights from Dollar Tree and some florals from Michaels. With the string lights, I put their battery packs into a little metal pot um, that I got from Dollarama. However, I'm sure a small um, terracotta pot or any sort of little container you could get from Dollar Tree would work also. I put the battery packs in them so that they would be hidden and then wrapped the lights down around the levels. Then I cut apart some greenery florals from Michaels and found that I was able to stick them into the ends of the bamboo sticks. After I was happy with where they were all placed, I came, went back with some hot glue and just held them in place with a small dab of hot glue. Then I put two of the bushels of greenery into the top of the bucket, again to kind of disguise and hide the battery packs. And that was it for this DIY. 